Behold, self-adjustable eyeglasses. But where do they come from? Meet Joshua Silver, a professor at Oxford University. Oddly enough, Josh Silver is not an optometrist. He's an atomic physicist. One day in 1985, during a casual conversation about optical lenses, Josh hit upon a novel notion. Would it be possible to make self-adjustable eyeglasses? After all, few people in third world countries had access to an optometrist. And the expensive maintenance required made glasses an unaffordable luxury for many people who needed it the most. Josh knew the answer had to be low cost, flexible, and essentially one size fits all. Here's how the self-adjustable eyeglasses work. When users put them on for the first time, they turn dials on the sides of the frame, right by the temples. These dials are attached to syringes that inject or remove fluid to adjust the curve of the lens. The lenses are hollow and made of a strong, flexible plastic. Filling the lenses makes them expand, while reducing the fluid makes them contract. Since users are looking through the lenses while adjusting them, they are able to find the best possible prescription. After this adjustment, the users seal the valve and break off the fluid mechanism, leaving nothing but an ordinary pair of spectacles. With the self-adjustable eyeglasses, Josh had struck at several vision-related problems in the third world. More than 30,000 of these eyeglasses have been distributed across the globe, 